Welcome back to another NFL video, and in this video, we have a couple things to talk about NFL-wise, Mac Jones and his injury status, and then Odell Beckham Jr. and his injury slash team status as well. But starting things off with Mac Jones and the Patriots, reports are saying that there's actually a decent chance that Mac Jones is available to play this Sunday when they go to Cleveland to play the Browns. So in the post-game or the post-practice press conferences today, there's a lot to talk about Mac Jones, and you know when you're asking asking Bill Belichick a question. It's always going to be something. He's never just going to give you the straight answer. So people were asking about his chances to play, and he was just saying the same stuff, like there's a chance he'll be able to play. But then they said, is the starting quarterback job max when he's ready to play? And his response was, we will see. Obviously, this is Bill Belichick, so I'm not going to go around overreacting, thinking that there's an open quarterback competition between Bailey Zappi and Mac Jones, because in my opinion, I don't think there is. I think I think this is Mac Jones's job. He was a rookie last year, the 15th overall pick the, in that draft when he made his rookie season, and I just think there's no way that Bailey Zappi has any chance of taking this starting job from him. People are joking around comparing Bailey Zappi to Tom Brady for the Patriots because he's a late round pick, and yes, he has looked pretty good in his first couple starts, lost to the Packers in OT, but that was an impressive performance, then was part of a 29-0 beatdown of the Lions this last Sunday, but Mac Jones Jones proved last year he is their guy. If the Patriots are having problems, it is not Mac Jones because Mac Jones looks like he can fit into an offense, be a very elite game manager as far as not giving the ball away, and he's a very good quarterback. He was out of Alabama, drafted 15th overall for a reason. This is a first-round talent you're talking about. You're not giving up on this guy just because Bailey Zappi had a couple good starts. Obviously, people like to overreact, but the point of this video is Bill Belichick. He did say we will see, but that's just a Bill Belichick check answer. I'm not thinking there's any chance that Mac Jones' job is stolen, but the good news is Mac Jones could be able to play after it looked like he would miss a a lot of time. It looks like it might only be two weeks, maybe three weeks if he sits out one more. Let me know your guys' thoughts on Mac Jones returning. For the second part of this video, we're going to be talking about Odell Beckham Jr. As we know, OBJ, he tore his ACL the same day he became a Super Bowl champ, February 13th with the Rams, but his recovery is going to allow him to return this season. Some ex executives think it will be around December or something like that, but whenever it is, OBJ proved last year that he is still a very, very talented wide receiver and he could produce so much at a high level for any team that signs him. So there's definitely Definitely going to be a lot of suitors interested and right now I'm just talking about who could be the best fit for Odell Beckham Jr. Let me know what you guys think. We've heard rumors with so many teams really because this is a guy that can come in and benefit basically every offense like we saw with the Rams last year. A huge addition. Obviously there's a potential that he re-signs there. He liked it there. As long as they offer him the money that could be a good fit. The Buffalo Bills have been talked about. His teammate from last year Von Miller has actively been recruiting him. I think that would be insane if he got paired up with Josh Allen. There's so many other teams. The New York Giants, that could actually be an interesting reunion. They're 4-1, and one, but one thing they don't have is a wide receiver, and OBJ could actually go in there and be a wide receiver one right away. There's a lot of other teams. The Ravens have been talked about. The Packers could be a team that's in need of a wide receiver big time. Ravens and Packers are two contenders that have been in the talks a lot of time. I feel like whenever you're hearing about Odell Beckham Jr. these days, the Rams might be one of the favorites to re-sign him. Then you hear teams like the Bills because Von Miller's recruiting him. The Packers because they need a ton of weapons right now. And then obviously the Baltimore Ravens as well. They lost Marquise Brown this offseason. They have Rashad Bateman. He's a little banged up. They have Mark Andrews but one more guy like OBJ seems like he would fit perfectly in that offense. Let me know what you guys think. OBJ, he's going to be back before we know it and he's going to make a big impact wherever he signs. Let me know who you think should sign him.